Welcome to the Fundamentals of Social Media Marketing course here at SCM Rush Academy. I am your instructor, Neil Schaefer, and I am excited to be spending time with you to provide you education on the fundamentals of social media marketing. Let's first begin with module one, the background for your social media marketing strategy. I think it is important before embarking together on our long social media journey to understand how fundamental changes in consumer behavior and communications technology have led to the digital revolution and the ubiquitous world of social media that we live in today. Understanding this background will help you get the most out of this course. So although you might be tempted to skip ahead to the later, more tactical modules in this course, I urge you to join me for a few more minutes so that you have the same perspective on social media marketing that I do. We first need to understand that we are living in a truly digital first world. Now, for those of you who remember life before the internet, for instance, in the old days, if we wanted to find out information about our medical situation, we pretty much had to go to a doctor. Today, a majority of people will first go to the internet looking for a solution to their medical problem rather than visiting their doctor. In the past, people used to have to go to a realtor to seek help in buying a house, but today more than 80% of Americans will use the internet as part of their search for their next home or apartment. Now, many companies still spend a lot of money on the traditional marketing channels of past before the internet, such as television, newspapers, radio, magazines, trade shows, etc. But the savvy companies of today, especially startups, will completely bypass these traditional marketing channels and instead invest a majority of their marketing budget in the newer digital and social channels. Now, the old buyer's journey was limited to these traditional marketing channels, which often meant that simply the more advertising money that you spent, the more eyeballs you received for your products and therefore the more sales we received. That simply is not true in this day and age when people are spending a majority of their time on the internet via a PC, tablet, or smartphone. We also need to understand we live in a world where everybody uses every digital channel at their disposal to look for information. That means that perhaps someone might have saw a TV commercial or heard a radio advertisement for your product, but inevitably before purchasing your product or service, they'll probably end up going on the internet, doing searches for people talking about your company, maybe even checking out your social media profiles, in addition to potentially doing some hashtag searches for related products. This is all part of the modern buyer and how they are in complete control of market information the only way for your company to be heard in this new buyer's journey of today is to become a party and communicate your story in this new ocean of content and conversation that we call social media.